Hey Alex, what are you playing? Uh, just working on a new tune of mine for tonight. What instrument is that and what other instruments do you play? This is a soprano saxophone, but I play all the saxophones. Uh, and I play some woodwinds like the flute and the clarinet. They're all over here, sitting on my stand. Wow. When did you start working at Grand Hotel? I started working at the Grand in May of 2001. How did you get this job? The agency that books our jazz festival here, they asked the great trumpeter Lewis Smith, who's one of my mentors, uh, for a recommendation, and he recommended me. So the rest is history, I guess. Oh, speaking of jazz festival, what can you tell me about this year's festival? Oh, it's going to be an amazing festival this year. We have Grammy Award winning vocalist Cecile McLaurin Salvant and perennial jazz festival favorite John Pizzarelli coming in. So it's going to be a great one. Nice. You've performed with some great artists in your career. Who's the most famous artist you've worked with? Oh, that's a great question. I played with so many, uh, you know, I wouldn't want to name just one, but if I had to, I'd go with Aretha Franklin, who I had the honor of playing with back in 2014. That's amazing. You've also performed with some great musicians on staff here at the hotel. Can you name anyone? Well, if I had to just name one, I would name my good friend Peter Mielich, who's one of the greatest piano players in the world and who I've had the honor of playing with for over 15 years now. Wow. We know you're also an associate professor of saxophone at Belmont University in Nashville. What do you enjoy most about teaching? I love getting the opportunity to bring my students up here to play with me every summer and to watch them grow and to see them go on to do great things. That's probably the most satisfying part of teaching for me. That's great. So you're based in Nashville during the off season. Can you tell us about what kind of work you do there? Sure. Well, it's a great music city. And when I'm not teaching, I'm really excited to get involved in the recording industry in Nashville sometimes. So. All right. Our last question for you. What inspired you to become a musician? Well, uh, to be truthful, probably um, becoming a little more popular than I was at the time. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> Thank you, Alex, for taking some time to answer our questions today. You're welcome. Thank you.